Let's go for Dave Thurston, everybody. <laughs> Chicago's better than Phoenix in every single possible way. It's awesome. Except for one way. There is one thing that Phoenix, you know, no one drums on a bucket in Phoenix. <laughs> <laughs> no one. No one does that. It's everywhere here. It's ridiculous. You can't get away from it. <laughs> one more time for Ian. <laughs> Drummers. And I don't like those um, those like uh, pills, the diet pills that show like the before, during, and after of a guy. And, you know that took a pill and that he's like goes from fat to thin to like super buff in like three days because he took a pill. I hate those. You like that? I hate it. It's the same guy, the same day. They shaved him, tanned him, told him to suck in. It's. <laughs> <laughs> well, why did I buy those pills? I should have seen through that. It could be a TV commercial, and I would do that commercial. You know. Before I started using Metabolite, I looked like this. <laughs> In a short time, I was looking and feeling better. And today, I look and feel great. So don't sit around on the couch. Apply yourself. Metabolite can work for you. That's good. <laughs> Glad you like that or laughed or you amused me with it because I spent a lot of time <laughs> naked in front of a mirror. I tell myself not to do that joke until I get a tan or get in shape or less body hair. That's weird. Who <laughs> needs to have that? All right. That's good. I like that. I don't want to brag, but I learned to be a gentleman from my grandmother. Yeah. You can woo for that. That's cool. I, uh, but then I went to a gentleman's club. <laughs> Grandma was way off on that. <laughs> so I relearned everything, you know, but I did. And I was at Thanksgiving, and I had my elbows on the table, and uh, my grandma goes, that's not gentlemanly, act like a gentleman. So I kicked over the table, and I'm like, I'm down, i show you what you got, gonna get in. <laughs> like gentlemen do, you know. do that that close to Christmas, you don't get any uh, Christmas presents. So that's what a comedian's supposed to say at that point in a joke. So also true about me, you might be uh, a little impressed, but I make uh, $18,000 a year. <laughs> a little sarcasm, that's cool. But uh, I used to work at the University of Phoenix there, and I work here uh, in Chicago, Phoenix. We call people and make them go to school whether they want to or not. You know, and just make them do the application online over the phone. Some people can't even do that. And uh, that's kind of a red flag, you know. It's college. It's going to get harder. <laughs> Having trouble with the app, might want to pull out now, I don't know. <laughs> But it's ridiculous. Some people just, I can't get it to go to the next page. Uh, did you fill out all the boxes? No. <laughs> fill out the boxes. This is easier for you than it is for me, huh? It's hot. <laughs> Let's play rock, paper, scissors. One, two, three. Scissors. What do you have? Rock. No, I'm being honest. Honesty is hot. It's so hot. <laughs> you know who I want to be? Paris Hilton? No, Paris Hilton. Er, yeah, you said that? Yeah. I said that. Yeah. I said that. That's hot. She's hot. That's hot. Let's go drum on a bucket sometime. <laughs> I just added that just now. So we're heading forward. You saw it just now. I like uh, how washing machines go eh when they're done. You know, if they didn't do that, would people just like freak out? Be like, what the hell? This was on a minute ago. What is going on? I just bought that. Oh, it's done. Could have used an indicator. That would be awesome. I yelled a lot. 
out for that one, I apologize. <laughs> the uh, elevators are the same way. When you get to your floor, it goes bing! I don't think that you need that. I think people know when to get off the elevator, you know, but, oh, dude, already? I'm fast. People know when to get off the elevator, though, you know what I mean? Like, there was a meeting of elevator improvement. Somebody brought up the idea, you know, like, hey, make it go bang when they get on the elevator, you know, the level. It's like, geez, Otis, I thought you were uh, going overboard when you suggested every floor lights up. That would be a little overkill. <laughs> No, do you need the light or do you need those? Do you love these things? Am I the only one who's annoyed in elevators like this? <laughs> Apparently. All right, that's cool. 18 grand a year gets you an education too. I'm irritated all the time. Can you tell? <laughs> Me and Ian are the only ones. <laughs> I like that one. But uh, so some guy said that. But. What if people don't see the doors open when it stops? Then we'll put mirrors everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> but if you're gonna drive an SUV, appreciate it and love and make the most of it. You know what I mean? I saw this guy the other day at the mall. He had one of those uh, H2 Hummers. You know, with like an 18 lit inch lift and like the huge tires. It's like a thousand horsepower for off roading. He slowed down to go over a speed bump. <laughs> <laughs> that is unacceptable, folks. That is not in the commercial for that vehicle. It would be a terrible commercial if it was. Uh, you know what the, the uh, license plate said? It said testosterone. <laughs> Actually, it didn't even say, it said tis tis mm. <laughs> <laughs> That's, There's like eight more minutes of that joke, but uh, there's also like 47 comments. Actually, we're not, we're almost done with the show. You guys are doing a good job. Give uh, Dave Odd another round of applause. <laughs>